Hi there. So for this question, we're asked to express 3x squared plus 9x plus 10 in the form of 3 times all of x plus p squared plus q. And this particular form is called completing the square. So I'm assuming that you're familiar with completing the square. If not, do check out the tutorials on this. So we'll start off with that quadratic expression there. And what I do is I look at the first two terms when I've got a number in front of the x squared and just pull whatever number this is out in front of a bracket. So for this example, it's going to be 3 times x squared plus 3x. Then I close the bracket. So that's giving me then the first two terms, 3x squared plus 9x. Put the last term on the end, plus 10. And then I complete the square across these two terms here. So just put 3 and then big square bracket and then in here an open bracket all squared. So you put x and then you halve the coefficient of x. So half of 3 is 1.5 or just leave it as 3 over 2. So when you square this out you're going to get x squared, you're going to get plus one and a half x, then you're going to get another one and a half x, making the three x, and then you're going to get plus three over two all squared, which is nine over four. We don't want that nine over four. It's not in x squared plus three x, so we subtract it, minus nine over four, and square off that bracket there. So this inside the square brackets then is x squared plus three x. Then we put the plus 10 on the end. So we now expand the bracket, so we've got that this is identical to 3 times the first term in here, which is x plus 3 over 2, all squared. And then we've got 3 times minus 9 over 4, which is minus 27 over 4. And then you've got just the plus 10. And cleaning this up further, We've got the first term, 3 lots of x plus 3 over 2, all squared. And then minus 27 over 4 plus 10. Think of 10 in quarters as 40 over 4. 40 over 4 minus 27 over 4 is plus 13 over 4. 13 quarters. And you can see I've now got it in this format. Okay. If we were asked to quote P and Q, not that we are, but if you were, P would be 3 over 2 and Q would be 13 over 4. Alright?